is uh, Sam Armitai. Uh, I worked as Professor of Palliative Medicine at the University of Sheffield for 20 years. I've now retired from that position, but I'm more active now in cancer research and in producing guidelines. My first talk today was about the uh, new research in the mechanisms of cancer pain. Why do we get pain in patients with cancer? It's not only the cancer, cancer can cause pain, directly by invading into the tissues and bones and we know a lot more now about how cancer initiates pain in the bones really through an inflammatory mechanism stimulating nerve endings but also chemotherapy and surgery and other cancer treatments cause pain as well and then finally the third, gr third group of pain is pain caused by comorbidity older people who've got arthritis osteoporosis so cancer pain now is a much more complicated thing and that's what I was talking about what I was talking about was the guideline we produced in 2015 which is the NICE NG31 guideline for care of the dying adult and the focus of that guideline was how do we provide good clinical care at the bedside for someone who's in the last two or three days of life. Unfortunately, when it came to things like symptom control, the research evidence is very poor. So we had to come up with ways of making recommendations based sometimes on expert opinion of the committee, not only from research. But what I've tried to show in this lecture is how we make a guideline based on uh, respecting patients' wishes and their preferences, as well as the best research evidence that we have. Thank you.